My name is Brittany Boyd. I play basketball and I play for the New York Liberty. Here's Brittany Boyd to the hoop and scores the hoop. Uh, my name's Joe Hannafin. I'm an orthopedic surgeon at the Hospital for Special Surgery and I'm the co-director of the Women's Sports Medicine Center. So Brittany Boyd had uh, a rupture of her Achilles tendon in the beginning of the season in 2017. Um, and it happened all of a sudden. We were playing a game against Minnesota. It was the second game of the season. Came off a ball screen, and I thought somebody kicked me in the back of my foot. Um, so I turned around like, yo, why you kick me? Then I had some pain, so I tried to get up and walk, and I realized that I couldn't walk. She was running along. She thought someone kicked her actually in the back of the ankle, which is a classic story when you rupture Achilles tendon. We saw her back in the training room, and she had torn it through and through. She squeezed my calf. She was like, you tore your Achilles. And I was like, I didn't even know kind of what it was necessarily, not necessarily what it was, but I didn't know exactly how big of a problem it would be. Uh, so within two days, I think, of her injury, uh, we did a primary repair of her Achilles tendon. And um, it took her a full year of rehab to come back and play, but it really took her a whole second year to get her, her quickness and her speed back. So the recovery process was 9 to 12 months, and it took me 12 months to finally get back, like, playing the game. Um, but I started, my, I started my rehab here in New York with our trainers, um, with the New York Liberty, and once the season was over, I went back home. Um, Brittany was pretty sad right after it happened because it was the beginning of a season where she just was ready to, to just accelerate into that season. Um, so I think emotionally it was hard. Uh, but I think the whole team rallied around her and she was present through the whole season. Uh, she then went home to California and uh, rehabbed with a physical therapist there and was taken care of in the off season by a friend who's an orthopedic surgeon who was actually her team doc in college. I mean, she just really took care of me and it was, a, it was rough. I want to tell you it was, real, like, it was, real, it was a really like struggle. Um, but you know, she kind of kept me motivated and just kept me pushing and um, we figured it out all at the end. You know, every athlete I've taken care of who's at that sort of level, um, you're nervous. The first time you watch them go flying down the court, you're nervous. And then each time they do something, it gets easier and easier. And, and it was fantastic this year to watch her, you know, in the first preseason game because her quickness was back all the way. I mean, you hear stories of people like, oh, you know, I tore my Achilles, I was never the same, or I did this, I was never the same. But for me, um, I think once I just got over the, the issue of, um, kind of that it happened. Um, that I feel like the only thing I wanted to do is recover and um, do my rehab um, and kind of, yeah, get back to, you know, playing at a high level. Uh, I don't think she thinks about it at all now. She was probably at 90% last year in terms of her speed and quickness. And now you watch her, she, she does crazy things. She'll go flying down the court, Pass. dive for balls, and, you know, she doesn't think about it. Um, you know, she can, she can rebound, you know, get a defensive rebound against some women who are probably a foot taller than she is because she's got springs in her legs. And so now it's just fun to watch her. And I don't quite honestly even think about her Achilles anymore. I just like watching her play ball, so. I'm extremely happy um, I chose HSS. Uh, I think this is one of the top doctors in kind of the country. Um, and you know, especially, you know, Dr. Hannafin. She really took care of me um, as far as my Achilles and I couldn't be more, you know, happy that I did let her and allow her to, uh, you know, do the surgery. Mm -hmm.